another pair trying to make it into the top 12. Jim Head and Mike Neff. Neff not only tunes a funny car, he drives one. We ask him what it's like to do double duty. Oh, we're getting in the swing of it. You know, at first it was hard just trying to get the system worked out with who was going to do what and where we needed help at. So now that everybody's up to speed and we have a good system worked out, now going around tough when you're going to those final rounds and, you know, it's kind of like training, you know. So um, going to four finals in a row, my team, you know, I know they can do it. They're, they've been going rounds. They went to 11 finals last year. So um, now with me going to the four finals, doing what I'm doing, I think we're starting to hit our stride a little bit. Chris, the defending uh, champion at Englishtown now, got his first number one right here in Thunder Valley. Well, Nats in trouble, then Head gets in trouble. It's a 437 for Head, a 642. It's not going to change anything. Both of them are still out of the top 12, and it's only the top 12 that transfer. Watch Jim Head on the left side of your screen. He's going to get that right tire just out of the groove, and then it's going to drive him over towards the wall, which we see funny cars. You saw that back end really wash out. A little bit of surprise. Mike Neff struggled getting down that racetrack, but we saw the same thing happen in Englishtown on Friday, and he came back and was able to win on Sunday.